Welcome back to another exciting WordPress video, guys. My name is Daryl, and today I'll be talking about some of the best social media plugins for WordPress. So if you want to be able to follow you there, follow you on Twitter, follow you on Facebook, all that cool stuff, these plugins will help you get more engagement. Now, the first on the list is Super Socializer. In fact, I do have a full tutorial on this specific plugin in the description below. It's a free plugin. And what I like about this plugin specifically is that it does social icons, adds the sharing. But one thing I did like about it the most was the fact that it has the social login feature. So here you can kind of see they can log in with a certain social ID. Uh, here you can kind of take a look at their share and like buttons. You can share it to Facebook. You can share it to uh, LinkedIn and all those other stuff. You can share it to Google Plus. Oh, no, 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 no. You cannot share it to Google Plus because Google Plus is dead. It is officially gone. Google finally admits that it's done. It's gone with no one uses it. I mean, I would only post stuff on there just just for SEO, like I wouldn't, I wouldn't like go on it. Like who's on Google Plus today? You know, like I wouldn't use it. But uh, Super Socializer definitely is a great social media plugin. Be sure to check that out. It's a free plugin. And again, I do have a full tutorial on it in the description below. Next is Social Warfare, and this is a plugin that I actively use on my website. So if you want to see it in action, let me go ahead and show you really quickly. So right here, you can kind of see that I have this article right here on the top seven best booking plugins on my website. And right here is the Social Warfare plugin. I like it because it just does its job for me. To me, I just said, all right, it does its job, shows the amount of shares. I want people to share it on LinkedIn, Twitter, and Facebook. Now, there are other social media outlets you can you know, put it on for, such as uh, Pinterest or other ones, uh, or Google+. Plus. Everyone's gonna have to update that because uh, Google+, Plus is pretty much dead now. Mix, I don't know what Mix is, but you can share it on Mix. And then I personally use this plugin. They also have like content lock, so if you want people to keep reading, it has a lot of features in it. They do have a free version, and they also do have a pro version. I do have the pro version, so if you wanna go ahead and check that out, I do recommend Social Warfare. It's on my website, so if you wanna see it firsthand, you can go ahead and check it out. And another one on the list, the next on the list, is the Monarch plugin by Elegant Themes. And this is probably one of the best social sharing plugins out there and it's just really really clean and it actually has the ability to have the on the left side where it says like uh, share it with this so you can see it has the floating sidebar which is really cool but it also has the above or below contents and it actually has a widget as well it even has an automatic pop-up so uh, this plugin has a lot of information packed in on it and i'm actually using this on my website right now so right here on the right side you see these little icons these little colorful beautiful icons and this right here is the Monarch plugin. And I actually do have a full tutorial on the Monarch plugin as well in the description below. It is $89, but you also get the Divi theme with it. Yes, the number one best selling, best rated plugin or best theme in the world. So if you wanna know how to use that uh, theme, I do have a tutorial on that one in the description below because that comes with the Divi theme as well. Next is Social Pug. Social Pug is just another one I, I saw, I liked. I messed around with it for a little bit. It pretty much does its job. Uh, right here, you can kind of see how it integrates the number inside of the icon for social warfare. It actually integrates it outside of it. So, you know, it's just depending on what you like, you know, which one works out for you, you can kind of check it out. It also shows on the right side of the screen or on the left side of the screen. So right here, you can kind of also change the button types. Very similar to the Monarch plugin. So be sure to check out the social pug plugin. Next is Mass Share. Now this plugin, when you actually go to the page, it actually starts loading the numbers really quickly. So it shows you the numbers and it kind of encourages engagement. It does have some decent social sharing icons as well. Uh, here, another YouTuber named, uh, uh, what's, what's her name? I forgot her name, uh, Katrina. She kind of goes through it, but the video is very old. They might want to update that. Um, you can actually uh, take a look at the screenshots right here. Um, I've seen this plugin on blogs, but I personally haven't used it. So, uh, well, although I haven't used it, it's still a very highly rated, highly used plugin in the WordPress community. So be sure to check that one out. Next is social media share buttons and social sharing icons. This right here is just basically, if you want to get the job done, this one is a great one. It's actually probably the highest rated on wordpress.org. It has a lot of different icons, a lot of different ways on how you can style it as well. And I've seen this plugin on various websites and you can kind of see just from, from right here, depending on the style of your website, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, you can kind of change it and adjust it to your niche. So for example, if you're like the retro guys, like the Nintendo, you know, they usually use black on a lot of their, their websites. So it's just, you know, something that you can use and you, know, you can add on your site, you know, here, you know, it looks clean, you know, it looks really clean. I do like it. It's a free plugin as well. So be sure to check this one out as well. All of these plugins are in the description below. 
if you want to go ahead and download those. And the next one is Sumo Me. Now, or Sumo.com, but the actual plugin is called Sumo Me, or the developer is called Sumo Me. And here on the left side, you can kind of get a glimpse of it. It also works for content as well. And this right here is actually the plugin. Uh, it's kind of hard to find out what it is because uh, the name of it kind of uh, it kind of throws you off. But uh, rest assured, it does share with social media. And you can go ahead and download it on their website. And they have like this full panel of various other social icons. In fact, one of the first tutorials I did was a pop-up builder. And that is with uh, Sumo Me as well. So they do have a lot of other um, add-ons and, and plugins on their main plugin. I think they call them like apps, you know, their uh, apps or whatever you want to call them. Uh, but it is a free plugin. You can go ahead and download. Now for their pro version, they do have a 14-day money-back guarantee. So I highly recommend to check that out. Here they kind of just go through a different, um, all the different things they have. They have a lot of different add-ons and um, I've used it in the past on my very first website and I loved it. You know, in fact, I use that actually to collect um, emails. So when I want to collect emails, I use their form builder as well. So be sure to check that one out. I will leave this in the description for you as well below. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry guys, it's Monday, you know, it's Monday. So let me know uh, what plugins you used. If you've used any of these plugins, let me know. Uh, I think Super Socializer was one of the best ones for social login. I do use the Monarch plugin because um, I use Divi and I like the actual style. In fact, right here on the left side, you can kind of see it. And <laughs> and if you click on this right here, it'll, it should display all of them. There we go. So there's a lot of different ways on how you can share a content with people on your website. So be sure to check these plugins out. I hope this video was helpful. Hopefully by now you can kind of make the choice on which social media plugin you should have for your website. And also, if you want to see these plugins firsthand, you can go to my website, darylwilson.com, where you can see the Monarch plugin and Social Warfare um, active. All right, so uh, see you guys in the next video. All right, and then until then, yeah, have a good day and take care. Bye.